From the moment it was announced, the woke race swap, gender swap, Robin Hood series made for modern audiences looked absolutely cringe. People knew it was likely going to get mocked and ridiculed. It looked like a disaster from the start. And in fact, it debuted with miserable audience scores. But just when you think something like this can't possibly get any worse... The director, the creator, has to go and open his mouth, and that's exactly what happened. We talked about this yesterday. After Director X, instead of sitting there looking at these bad reviews and keeping his mouth shut or maybe even reflecting on, wow, look at all these miserable reviews I had. It was down to a 1.6 on IMDb. Instead of saying, wow, maybe people don't really like my show. Maybe people don't like the fact that I took this character that people know, race swapped them, gender swapped them, made every good guy in the series a person of color, yet left the villains as the only white people in the show. Maybe people don't have a very positive feeling about that. Maybe I should recalibrate my storytelling and where it's coming from. No, instead... He just blamed the fans and said all these reviews must be fake. He even put out a video on Instagram and TikTok calling people like me specifically out. Well, it didn't go well for him after that because now the ratings have only gone down further as more people have drawn eyes to this show. A 1.2 out of 10 on IMDb. Considering the lowest score you can give something as a one star... This is pretty fucking bad. But he went back to social media where he tried to deny reality. Woke Robin Hood gets a 1.2 IMDb rating. Director X blasts racist fans. And here he is over on Twitter. For reference, this is a guy that has a decent following. 26,000 people following him. It's not like he's a nobody on Twitter. But he says this. Robin Hood is getting one stars from countries where the show doesn't air or stream. This is what y'all on? Review bomb IMDb for a show you haven't seen? Disappointed in y'all. A real mask off moment. Y'all looking like real goofs. And then advertises where you can watch it. It has six likes. This guy has 26,000 followers. This tweet has six likes. 123 comments. He's getting annihilated. And a lot of people are saying, you know, there's a thing called a VPN, right? That people can find ways to watch your show where it's not released. He says this. You've all arrived. I love how these folks see an obvious review bomb and say VPN. Y'all play really stupid. Unfortunately, you are the one, Director X, who is the dumb motherfucker in this situation because only five days ago, you specifically told people that if it wasn't available in their country to use a VPN. This is his tweet. Someone asked, does it have an American broadcast yet? I'm in the middle of an international move. He says, not yet. It's VPN time. This is from September 28th. Five or six days ago, your dumb bitch ass was sitting there telling people to use a VPN. Now you're saying, well, that's not an excuse. All y'all are saying VPN. That's crazy talk. What an absolute fucking moron. So of course I retweeted this idiot. You literally told people to use a VPN and watch it internationally a few days ago. Now you're acting like it's a wild thing to suggest. I know this is hard to imagine, but maybe people don't like the show. And of course, he then has to reply to me because he can't keep his mouth shut. Okay, bud, it's an obvious bombing. Even if these peoples actually watch the show, you all act like what is in front of our face isn't happening. I guarantee you there's some people that didn't watch the show that reviewed it. I know that that's the case. I'm sure some of those one-star reviews are from those people. I also guarantee that's the fact for some of the 10-star reviews that have popped up there. This is something that happens from time to time, but I don't have an IMDb account. I've never rated a show, let alone Robin Hood on IMDb. I'm not sitting there doing that. There might be some people that do it. Who knows? But one thing is for sure, your show is getting destroyed. And even though there may be some fake one stars and fake 10 stars thrown in there, you can't deny the obvious backlash to your show. And for you to pretend, this is the dumbest thing he could have possibly said. It's an obvious bombing. Even if these people actually watch the show. So think about what he's saying. If you watch the show... And if you reviewed it, because it's negative, it's an obvious review bombing. Indicating what? Is the assumption that if you don't like something, you should just, ju- just not rate it? Is that what you're trying to tell everybody? This guy is a fucking moron. And he's getting annihilated for it. Now he's still floundering around. Look at this ratio. Three likes to 80,000 comments. Nobody was even talking to this guy or about this guy until he decided to make a TikTok blaming angry racist nerd communities for why his show wasn't doing very well. 
and he continues to play victim, continues to double down, and he's too fucking retarded to remember what he wrote just a few days ago, advocating that people use VPNs and then trying to be like, that's not an excuse. No one could have possibly used a VPN to watch my series. You're dumb as fuck, and you're making everything worse for your dog shit woke Robin Hood series. All it's doing is drawing more attention to the fact that you made this piece of shit. And the more people watch, the more they seem to dislike it. A 1.2 on IMDb. Let me know what you think about all this in the comments below. We'll see if Director X continues to talk. It doesn't go well when he continues to talk, but I guess we'll see what his next step is. I'm sure he thinks it'll be smart, but in all likelihood, it'll be really fucking dumb. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Smash a like button, subscribe to the channel, ring the bell for notifications, share this video out there, and I'll talk to you later.